Hello, and thanks for checking out ChartGuys.com. We're proud to be one of the most successful technical analysis communities online, teaching you the skills to become a more confident, effective, and informed trader. Join our community of hundreds of analysts worldwide working together to learn the charts, generate profit, and achieve financial independence. Sign up for a one-week free trial, no credit card required, for access to daily live chart analysis and market coverage, a thriving chat community, along with dozens of hours of exclusive educational materials. We look forward to seeing you. Let's check out some charts. Checking in on natural gas and UNG, starting with the weekly time frame. So a significant bullish reversal candlestick, and we have a lot of work to do for the bulls, but this is a great start to try and change the trend. We have to break this level of 321.4 to break the lower highs. And we do have a new support established at 2827, but anything under that level is just going to be another lower high keeping the bears in control. So seeing that on the daily time frame, we can see that the bulls are likely to hold on for at least a bit. And I say that because we have our high, low, lower high, lower low, lower high, lower low, and we have now broken the lower high pattern. As soon as we got over 2995, that was a significant break because before that point, anything under that level was just another lower high in this pattern. So now that we have broken it, we are still overextended. You see this bearish reversal candlestick with a big upper wick of profit taking. That's a shooting star. If we see a break of 2984 and we begin to pull back this coming week, we'll look to establish a higher low. And we're going to assume that a higher low is coming because we did break the lower high pattern. Had it just been another lower high, we would be looking for a more likely than not lower low to see that pattern follow through. But the pattern has broken, so now we're looking for a higher low to form. The four hour time frame is seeing healthy consolidation. 2984 and 2978 but just cautious of further consolidation due to that daily chart being extended and due to this four hour rsi not staying above the 70 level long and we have just poked it above it recently and are now pulling back so a healthy consolidation anticipated on the daily time frame looking for a higher low to form after the break of the lower high pattern ung the key bull break was at 651 our resistances are 660 and 670 and in terms of support we're looking down again. We haven't established many clear supports on the uh, daily time frame on this four-day bull move. And some of these days, if you were making bullish entries, they were not ideal as we then pulled back for the rest of the day. But it's been a really a strong four-day bull move. We just have to establish support on the daily time frame, which we have not done yet on this move. On the weekly time frame, there's that middle Bollinger Band resistance, which has been rejecting the price pretty much since all the way back in January. We did have one week closing above it. But now four of the last five weeks have rejected from this level. It's at 660. It's going to be in the upper 650s tomorrow. And we'll be looking to see if the bulls are able to turn this trend around. And step number one, we'll be getting over the weekly middle Bollinger Band resistance before needing to break 698 for a significant bull break on this downtrend on the weekly time frame. So long story short, the bulls are in control of the short term. They're due for some short term consolidation. But the weekly chart still favors the bears and the bulls have a lot of work to do. So not as clear a sentiment as some of these other commodities out there. The It all depends on your time frame. Long term, you're bearish. Short term, you're bearish. Mid term, you're bullish looking for the higher low. And by mid term, I'm referring to the next uh, two weeks to play out looking for a higher low on that daily. So I appreciate you watching. We'll continue to monitor the daily chart here and looking for that higher low on natural gas after this big upper wick of profit taking. Hope you have a good rest of your weekend and we'll see you soon.